Oh, Riva. Tammy, I didn't see you come in. You probably shouldn't be hearing this. I'm not a baby. No, she isn't. Look, Olivia, Jonathan had nothing to do with Marissa's death. He loved her. She was his mother. He did love his mother, Olivia. Yes, and, and Marissa loved him. I don't want to think this of Jonathan, okay? I've already lost one family member. My son has problems, okay? Issues, but he's not a murderer. I agree with you, Aunt Reva. But... What? What? What do you know? Nothing. Nothing about your sister. I... I just... I saw Jonathan at the computer at Lewis, and he was doing something, but whatever it was, he didn't want me to know about it. He seemed freaked out. Ugh. I'm sure it had nothing to do with any of this. Sweetie, you should probably go. Yeah, fine. He didn't kill anyone. Alfred raised him. Alfred's been posing as Nate for quite some time. Jonathan knew that you were working with him, yet he didn't say anything. He did. He tried to talk me off that job and away from Nate several he times. He never exposed Nate, which means he's protecting that. Me, which means he could know something. Creep beat on my kid for years. There was a reason why he didn't expose Nate, and it was because he was scared. Yes, he was scared, which means he, means he would go along with his father's plan. I just need to talk to Jonathan. I just need to feel Nate him did out. This. He killed your sister, and I'll prove it if you help me. If I help you, set him up. He's a bully. I know how to deal with bullies. Really? Then why did it take you so long to figure out who he was? He has been playing you for weeks. I admit that I was taken in at first. Taken in? Riva. He had you wrapped around his little finger. The way I see it, good old Nate is setting you up to be his next victim. Mm -hmm.